possible before sunset because I'm going to be in Flagstaff early in the morning so as soon as it gets dark that's it train arrives early in the morning so I have to wait for a while before it lightens up at 6 o'clock Okay, I have arrived Flagstaff, Arizona now I'm gonna go to McDonald's first because it's five o'clock in the morning so McDonald's is 24 hours of breakfast with a coffee or something and wait for the daylight. <laughs> yeah, it is spinning a little bit. I didn't sleep much, a couple hours only. And um, Flagstaff is actually 8,000 feet up. So I can feel the altitude. It takes a little bit of time to get used to. Tomorrow morning I'm heading to Grand Canyon. So today I have to figure out how to get there, and how to get back, and uh, how to get my bike there. Um, look, 31 degrees. We are high up, 8,000 feet, that's why daytime is going to be warm, nice, 70s. I'm in Blackstaff, Arizona, and look at those mountains. So I'm going to the closest park, they have the lake there too. So let's go check it out. So I'm going to check out this place warming up nicely it was so cold in the morning 31 <laughs> but now it's already 50s and it's gonna be 70s today couple of mallard ducks I saw an American good and I see osprey yeah, they have the nest there. Very nice. Osprey is circling around. Yeah. So I'm gonna just ride around and see what this place has to offer. There you go. Is that a lesser cold winch? Yeah, I think so. It's singing too. Ooh, there's a woodpecker. <laughs> That's a northern flicker. I didn't know that the flickers are here. Look, he's carrying the stuff, he's building a nest. Yeah, I reckon good. He yeah, definitely is building a nest. When they come to Florida, they come in the winter months. Look at this beautiful view. <laughs> and no leaves. Because we are so high up, even at the end of April, leaves are not out yet. Is the Chanko. Dark guy Chanko is singing. I've arrived. I'm at Grand Canyon, Mare Campground. And this is my campsite. I got the tent up and uh, I'm cooking, making something to eat. 
And then after that, hop on my bike and go in to see the Grand Canyon. Ooh, wow, that's a new bird. Wow, this is so cool. Mountain chickadee. Another bird to my list. Okay, mountain chickadee. Guess what? New lifer. That's the black throated grey warbler. Never seen it. Do you hear him singing? You see? Now he's nicely visible. Oh, look at that. Oh, flew. Here you go, elks. Huge. Wow, that's so cool. <laughs> Did you see that? Yeah, human is actually. Look at this view. That's magnificent. Okay, let's check out this one. <laughs> to grasp the space here. It's like miles and miles. There are people on the trail. See? See how far it is. It's like 20 miles long or more. So I'm just gonna ride around checking out the vistas. But right now I'm heading to the trailhead. And look at that, they have live music. Friday, that's why, or maybe they have every day live music. Okay, canyon views coming up. That's how the trail goes. On the side of the canyon. Yucky Point. Wow. What a view. Look at that. <laughs> what a view. That's the people on the bikes. That's the Pipe Creek Vista. Look at my view. Beautiful. And the spotty that Dovi is singing. Right there on top of this tree nearby. Wow. You can really see the layers. Spotty Dovi. How do you like my view? <laughs> Magnificent. So peaceful, yeah. No one is around. Ooh, wow. 
I wouldn't want to get to to get too close of that. My bike fell over. So that's one of the prettiest views so far. Wow. That is scary. So that's my view in the Grand Canyon. So cool. <laughs> go straight down. That's a long way down. So a few more steps and then it would be a thousand feet drop. So I'm not gonna get close. Yeah, long way down. That's how the trail goes, top of the rim. Beautiful. Grand Canyon has the free shuttle bus, takes you from one end to another. So that's the beginning of trail down. So I'm just gonna walk a little bit, but not much. And that's how it goes. Zigzagging all the way down. Wow, this is so cool. Maybe one day I'm gonna hike all the way down, camp in the bottom, or maybe hike all the way through. Who knows? But not this time. I just don't have enough time. What time is it? 5.30. Okay, one more hour and then, or maybe two hours before sunset. So now I'm heading back. Look at the elk. Two of them actually. Hello guys. How are you doing? Oh, doing alright? <laughs> so cool. Riding on the top of the rim. Okay, I'm back. Now I'm gonna eat and uh, taking it easy today. I actually put the tent up to the wrong campsite first, then I moved it there. 